Welcome, my dear Capricorns, to your weekly reading from the 2nd of May to the 9th of May. We're going to have a look at oracle cards to get a lay of the land. And then we're going to pull tarot for more. Oh, look at that, for more information. Oh, this is quite a, it's quite a strong week for you. I think this week your dreams are going to be of the utmost importance. Something, you know, we've got this purple, a lot of purple in this card and a lot of purple in this card. You know, purple is our connection to spirit. And then we've got dreams and life purpose. Your dreams are going to play a very important role this week. And I want you to take note of them. And if you can, when you awake, when you awaken, just jot down points from the dream so you don't forget them. Because I I think you're going to be receiving very important downloads and messages this week. My dear Capricorns, there is something coming in that has to do with your life purpose. You might get messages about what it is that you should be doing or working in. You might get um, images. For each one, it's going to be very, very different. But this is a very important week in terms of if you've already found your life purpose the direction, maybe a little bit of direction you should take or messages that you need to know. If you haven't found your life purpose, there could be a lot of hints and messages coming through about the direction of your life purpose. Okay, Capricorn, let's now just pull some tarot to get some further clarification about what this all is in terms of your dreams and life. Whoopsie, that one jumped out. We've got the eight of we've got the three of swords we've got the two of wands the two of cups and our last card oops all jumping out let me just get a nice last card is the eight of wands all right so what we've been told here that there has definitely been a bit of heartache, disappointment and let down in the, the very um, recent past and you have walked away. You have been strong enough to walk away from something. It could have been a job, it could have been a life partner, a long-term relationship. You were very let down, very hurt and very disappointed and you've walked away. You see, we've got the red the red heart here and then taking taking your whatever is happening and you walk away into your your new future you've done a lot of thinking and planning and i think this is very much related your life purpose is related to this heartache whatever it was it could have been um, a love connection like i said before or it could it even have been walking away from a job or position but whatever this was it led way to finding your life purpose. And by finding your life purpose, we've got the two of wands here and the two of cups. By finding your life purpose, you're going to find your life partner as well. So this hurt, this pain, this disappointment, this sorrow, I know it was really hard, but it was a blessing in disguise because it opens the gateway for finding your life purpose and your life partner and I want you to know that this is not a long time coming this is going to you're going to see the seeds of it already it's all already going to start we've got the eight of wands which is a fast moving card things are going to start moving forward you're going to see signs of it pay attention to those dreams please they, they're very very strong and they're very very impactful and they've got a lot of messages I'm now just going to pull a card from ask your ask your guard, guides card and the card we get is grace oh that's absolutely lovely because i think that this is going to actually happen quite easily for you when i say i don't think that it's like there's going to be such a strong realization that is coming from your dreams about where you should be going in what direction that it's going to happen with ease and grace. You can see this little person dancing and being looked over by this beautiful white dove. We've got two twos here, which tells me there's just a divine partnership in terms of the work you do and in terms of love, and it's moving ahead at a nice, steady, quick pace. So there you have it. 
my dear Capricorns. I hope you enjoyed your reading. I wish you a wonderful week and I'm sending lots of love. Please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and give it the thumbs up if this, re if this reading resonated with you.